sort some things out on my screen yeah i close raid down at least for the hour mm -hmm. actually no i'll tell you what i will do i got a clan boss key i can quickly run yeah you got like 20 monitors there as well two <laughs> <laughs> uh. so that yeah so all right nightmare this Battle. time I'll... I started earlier, so I don't have any unexpected delays. <laughs> uh, no, yeah, what you were sending the money through each week? I thought it was like, you know, at the end of the three months. No, so, so you can feel it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I know it's, it's, so. it's, Thank you very much. It's, it's different when you get all together, but at the same time, who knows? Maybe you want to add it to the numbers there. It makes it easier. And this way, because after each stream, uh, because they, they've they sent me all the, the TLM all together. So after each stream, to make it fair, I'll take that part. So I divided like 15 streams on, on what they sent me. And then after each stream, I take that part, boom, split it, put it there. And then it's full transparency for them as well. Seeing that I don't oh, swap nice. it all. Yeah. And yeah. Today, uh, today was election day on the governance, and you know, someone won. Maybe I won first place, so I'm a custodian now. Well, uh, get into that again as well, because mm -hmm. it's something that does, you know, need to repeat. You know, it's what people have uh, wanted to play for eventually, yeah. aren't they? Yeah. Oh, oh, let me it's share my the, screen uh, as well. Uh, where's the screen? Which screen am I sharing? This one, entire screen, this one, here we go. Uh, and then that's an A3, and then it's an auto. And then I can close that down and forget about it. 
Close that down. Close that down. So let me let me see who's in chat. So shrimp is in chat. So yeah. So I even sent the tweet out. So. Well, have you? I yeah, even I, can't, I saw much. the post in the Discord. Yeah, yeah even well. even in Discord. See what you can drag in. Yeah, so pull in that riffraff. Yeah, now I'm gonna post it the even in. Go over to my main monitor. Even in. A uh, couple of other streams. He's no longer there. Okay, so where is it? Let's close the Twitter. There close you this go. one. That open. Boom. My tunes can stay on for a little bit. Mm, alien tools. Uh, let me see. And then the two main ones are one are. Um, Announcement. This, and then I want your stream open as well. Join us. Okay. Yeah, just posted in muted the telegram. And I think it should start so when I swap pa pa pa. Yeah, I even changed my webcam because the the green I didn't set the green screen properly because it I have to take it down, put it back up. So I just left it on the side and I need to put it properly eventually. When we become big uh, podcasters, we can have mm -hmm. a green screen room. <laughs> <laughs> so Full green screen room, right? Yeah. You never know. It could be the way to your millions. Yeah, I mean, we could be like Joe Rogan and stuff. Uh... Ew. <laughs> <laughs> that American or some American podcaster, so... So on here really that had like zero percent commission. Yeah. And it was like a two point one or something. Commission? What where? Uh, so yeah, the the commissions, you know, when you're choosing your land which to mine. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So see here on uh it's not uh, it's not live yet so well it's we're live but it's still starting soon so see here number ah, one so you are the top dog over there i mean i mean you know it is what it is it really it is what it is yeah i mean uh, fucking big boy bollocks over there that i'm looking at yeah the the guy in uh, in chat shrimp baguette tv he he made a tool he he was the first on this planet as well then he proposed a tool a website where people after they vote they get the nft points and then uh, they could use nft points to vote for people instead of a trillion and that that worked out because on on its website like let me show you so you go on that website which is miners union and more planets so all the planets together they well some of them they uh, pitched in with TLM so they can support the the voting of the people. So here I'm I'm number three. So people voted me for with TLM basically. No TLM with the NFT points, sorry. So he made this website with him and three other guys. So at the moment there's three planets here. Neri, which is who sponsored us. Yeah. Ne Neri, Neron, and uh, Aiki. So all three planets have contributed to this uh, website. So now they're contributing every week for keeping the TLM there staked and voting for the three people at the top here. So whoever's top three here, whatever they have in, in stock there, they can vote it for, for them. So. Well, you, get, you, you know, we can go back through all this as well in, yeah. uh, in this one. Yeah. But slowly, slowly. But it seems like lately people are not joining stream. They're, they're like they're joining stream after the stream ended. I've seen that. Oh, 
I've seen the stream, good. Or useful information. I said, yeah, but you could have jumped in and asked some questions. Oh, I was busy. So, well, it's fine. At least you've seen it. Yeah, before. well, no different than, uh, you know, a lot of my streams and things like that. Yeah. Sometimes they say it's too yeah, late. It's lurkers, people just sit there, watch and listen. Yeah. Uh, they may know the answers. They may not need questions. Exactly. That's why some of them say, oh, I was just, I just left the, the, the PC open on your, uh, your Twitch and that's it. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's fine. Fine by me. So let's see. Well, again, we have not typing in the stream, you know, so for mm -hmm. open for an hour. So that's, you know, that could be a minimum of 60 times 0 0.0025. Mm -hmm. If they send a message every minute. Yeah. I mean, I mean. Let me check. Uh, yeah, see the the bot is still it's still it's still active. I normally type that just to double check if the bot is active because sometimes. Uh, Do I have to put my one in there, yeah. Yeah, you can you can just double check. Yeah, because I am double checking. Yeah, already verified. Yeah, so it's there. Because the person that has the bot, sometimes the uh, it only happened once, but still the the server where it, his hosting is his tool fell down, so everyone was panicking. Oh, I'm not earning. <laughs> said, not earning, right. therefore I'm not typing. Yeah, but yeah, this is my chance. So see, I already made the proposal. I claimed the budget today. It was executed. It, it needed three votes, so mine plus two more. And now I'm gonna make a, a proper proposal for them. But yeah, let's see. Where's Neri? Let's see what's happening on Neri. The five custodians. Come on. I see the 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 game website still has some slow responses sometimes. So the five custodians. See, observation is still here. Remember, he was nearly yeah, didn't, yeah, yeah. didn't make it. So he nearly, was yeah. Six. He was like, oh, but he says he's six there again. Yeah, but he probably got the vote. But... Well, he's all yeah. So it's changed. Even uh... yeah. yeah. Go go back onto what you were just on that other little piece. That other... Can do it, I think. Yeah. Yeah, Max Infield, he was, he was number one previously. Yeah, but, and then it's uh, it's all about like the voting. by like 200k. Yeah, the voting power and then the voting decay as well. That means the longer the decay, like these ones, the, the power goes down. But yeah, it's a, it's a permanent battle here. The power of the galaxy. Let's see. Alright. Let's type in here as well. Just in case. So in case people want to join up, ask them questions. Yeah, we're at that time, so... I'm gonna jump in so show our pretty faces. Yeah, I'm good to go. Yeah. The children are dressed, so even if you're not behind me, you're gonna, not gonna see naked bottoms knocking around. Mm. Apes from the far reaches now. of the galaxy. Uh, Today's stream yeah, is so sponsored by Planet Nary and its syndicate, so stay tuned for an exciting broadcast. Let's see, because I... Good evening, Interstellar Explorers.
We're here to bring you the latest news and updates from the far reaches of the galaxy. Today's stream is sponsored by Planet Nary and its syndicate. So stay tuned for an exciting broadcast. We are back now. So, Lisa. Hello, Lisa. Hello, Imjam. Greetings, one and all. Greetings from the interstellar galaxy. <laughs> and then... Make sure I'm on the right one, eh? Yeah. And then we can... Let me do something. Well, if it works, let me see. Mm. This one, well, it's all right, like this as well. If they want a bigger screen, I can move myself and go full screen. Oh, can you hear us now? Yeah, yeah, everyone can hear us. Okay, wonderful. First things first, uh, for you, Xander, I need you to shift your Discord. There you go. Yep, let me move it on this side. As first well. question I wanted to actually ask you, yeah. Obviously, you sent me the tools to begin with, so it wasn't just yeah. manually going with the spade. Yeah. How how would you go about getting those standard capacity? You know, if, if I was just jumping on this and I didn't have you to, you know, pass them over to me or transfer, how, how would you get them? So there's a, there's a few secondary markets. So you'll need the wax, so... So like you every... need wax first. Yes. That, then my next question is, so yeah, you, okay, you would have to buy them or get them. Next question, following up from that is, how did the first people get them? So before they, yeah, because they used the, to drop... You know, somebody would have had to have got them in the first place. Yeah. In order for other people to start generating. Yeah, exactly. Hey, Boncasa. So at first, when the game launched in 2020... People were mining, so with the shovels, there was a initial sale. So in December 2020, when they saw they sold the land, they were in packs. So each pack was, it had the uh, lands and a few tools, random tools. So that was the first when it the game launched in 2020. They had tools and lands. So that's that was the initial sale, and so everyone that bought in, and then people have just literally mined with shovels. Yes. So how would you go about? Yeah, I, I still I still don't physically get where the original people would have got it from because they would would they have just had to have gone into a wax and bought it from alien worlds themselves with wax? No, it with... was on their website yeah. like alienworlds.io. Before there used to be like a, a sale pack somewhere here, so but now it's it's changed. But so, before, so it was like a starter pack. Yes, it yeah, was like a either, starter you pack. You either did it with your shovel or you picked a starter pack. Yes, exactly. Uh, and I think there's still packs around. Let me see, Alien Worlds land pack. I'm sure that you can still find them somewhere. Uh, Okay, so see, buy packs. So it was here, eat sale and wax sale. So you could buy them. So you can see my screen, yeah? Yeah, yeah, I can see it. So you can see so this it's one. like a booster pack of Pokemon cards, literally, yeah. as you were explaining to yeah. me uh, on Friday. Yeah, exactly. So the pack has eight items. So one card guaranteed to be land, drawn randomly from terrain, so on. Each of the seven remaining cards has the above probability of being the rarity listed. So it's common, rare, epic, legendary, or mythic tool. Yeah. So, and then for uh, the next pack, again, uh, dark special item, legendary, mythic, all rarities, and then you scroll down. These were like eight items, only tools. So you can see like, Guaranteed two rare items or better and again, these are all sold out like back then in, in December 2020. Uh, I could imagine so. Is there anything that 
Alien Worlds do, uh, did he do promos of these? I think I have seen in your Discord certain things knocking around, but I don't know if they would be like, um, I know it might saturate the market a little, but yeah. would they ever restock these or like now no, that they're gone? No, oh. there, there was only one sale, that's it, because they, they sold out everything they had in for sale. So the lands, there's no more. Only the ones that were sold and there's no more lands. So that was it. And then the tools, the tools from here and then people starting to sell them, use them and get other tools as well. But even people that started with just shovels, they could obtain NFTs from drop. So let's say you mine 10, 20 and times a day. That's what you said that they remove that eventually from people. Yeah. Um, creating too many accounts to exactly because I remember when I started I had the uh, three sta uh, I started with one uh, one shovel and then I said oh let me just buy two more shovels so I bought two more shovels and then after a day I started to get like seven eight NFTs a day so they were quite good so after that I upgraded to drills and I started getting like 10 15 NFTs a day and so, then obviously they were dropping too many NFTs with yeah. people making thousands and thousands and thousands of uh, accounts per yeah. person. Exactly. Uh, and then they had to stop. Yeah. Uh, you're mining NFTs. So technically there is a lot of NFTs knocking around. They just, you just got to. Yeah. On the secondary the market. market yeah. Find it. Yeah. So if you go on the secondary market, which it can be, there's a, a few secondary markets. Like if you go in in the the wax cloud wallet well my cloud wallet now it's called and you head over to let me load it up and get the pedals if anyone in chat like boncasa has any questions feel free to ask uh, i mean well uh yeah the bonkers <laughs> that's how i would read his name the bonkers the boncasa bon um you say they're late to the uh, blockchain. Literally, uh, what was I? <laughs> Two months? Yeah. So the new one doesn't work, so let's try the old one. Which still works. Yeah. So once you get to the Wax wallet, you go to the depths. And the depths are all the apps. So you can see here, games and let me see. Just market so, so these are all the games that you can go and get nfts yeah from. and then you have you just type market and then it, it will show you all the marketplaces so so yeah it's the atomic market i think um yeah atomic hub to... and then i normally use the nft hive but i'm wearing a atomic hub uh... <laughs> hoodie so <you> can... <laughs> Because there I've been, uh, yeah, I've been at one Special of their program. events. Yeah. Yeah. And then I've used all of them anyways, except for Wax Stash. This is where you can still find the Alien World packs because some people bought them, but never so opened them. I literally don't need to harass you anymore as if to yeah. say, what game can I go and get NFTs from? They're literally all there in my Wax wallet. I just go to Yeah, the... exactly. So. And then download and play. Yeah, exactly. So the thing with the NFT hive is that every sale you make or every purchase you make, you get the cash back in their token, which is honey. So let's say you spend 100 wax on one NFT, you get one honey back and one honey is like a, a two wax at the moment. So you get two wax backs. I bought a little discounted uh, price and then you would spend that on. Well, you either sell that, do you, or you just buy something for honey off there. Yeah, exactly. And then this latest one uh, I found, uh, champ, Chain Champs. It's showing like the, the live, the NFTs that go out live. So, well, whenever it works. <laughs> but yeah. I mean, obviously you're, you're well into it, so you know where you're looking. But if that was, yeah. obviously that is me. I'd be looking at all these thinking, do I really want to connect my wallet to that? Do I really want to connect my wallet to that? Because obviously it is a... Uh... In general, on Wax Wallet, they only 
publish here the the apps that are trusty so trusted so you won't find any scammy links here so Yeah, so yeah, I if, can yeah, I can definitely imagine that. Uh, obviously, not going to be put in the. Uh... Yeah. So you see, Alien Worlds here as game, but if you find like, there's other projects that are not listed here. Again, not not because they're scammy, but because they haven't been verified by Wax. So they can be legit projects, but if they're not verified by Wax, then then it won't actually appear. Yeah, until exactly. Until they get the verification. Exactly. I assume there's a few hoops that they have to jump through for that as well. Probably. So, yeah, well, see, I can mine now. It's mine. <laughs> yeah, I did mine. I got four minutes left on my mind today. But again, that, you know, I'm going back to the same question I asked on Friday. Yeah. Because I clicked mine again today, and it wasn't too long ago. It's probably the first time I had done it since Friday. I've been that busy. Yeah. My first mine today from the same location that I was mining on Friday, literally gave me something like 0.0017 or 0.0035, I think it was. Yeah. And literally on Friday, it was giving me like 0.03, you know, it was giving me a hundred times more. Yeah, stick a zero on the end of whatever it gave me in this one. Exactly. Which is why, again, I'm going to ask, Surely it is best just to bounce around the different places rather than just staying in one place to mine. Well, like I said, I'm. Or is it just an unfortunate mine that I did? Yeah, exactly. That what that's hap that what, that happens sometimes. So when that happens, you you just try and mine again and again. That's what I did yeah, as well. Yeah, I did uh, previously on. on on the Friday before before I swapped, I think I got like 0 0.035, no, you know, yeah, the minimum 35. Then I got 17, and then I got 35 again. And I'm like, you know, if I'm getting more for typing in your, in yeah. your stream, which I'm going to do now, say hello. <laughs> hello. There you go, and there's, there's more than a mind before. Yeah, just yeah. type a nine. Cha ching, cha ching, cha ching. <laughs> what the hell was that? So you uh, the, the the, play with it till. No, the door. Uh, delivery arrived. Uh, yeah, why not? <laughs> um, let me see. So we're in yeah. a custodians yeah. on Neary at the moment, yes? Yeah. And obviously it's now changed. Yeah. Rin, I week. think uh, Virin was like four or something. Uh, last week, yeah, or on Friday, he's now in first. What does he get from going from fourth to first? I think they're they're still. He, it's just the top five. Regardless. Yeah, exactly. Top top five are the the most important ones. So he doesn't get any extra any. He doesn't like get a, you know, two votes instead of one or something like that just because he's in first place. No, tap on the shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> slap on the shoulder and a slap on the ass. Good job. Yeah. Good job. Yeah, they're still Those well. Notes. As long as they do a good job, people will vote them again and again. So that's what keeps them up, because they keep working hard and creating good and proposals. And when you say good job, yeah. it just means the um, creator. Their ideas that they're posting to do with that current funding for that week. Yeah, yeah exactly. Because they come so up with proposals. Iron's uh, proposal. That's the word I'm looking for. Yeah, like if you scroll down on uh, on uh, on Neri here, you can see their proposal. Who created the proposal? So let's see. Varin has B52. You look who made oh, what? Oh, I can. I think you can even click on his name. And you can see the proposals underneath him. Yeah, so you can see the latest proposal was the 3.2 million. So it was fund the organization for the protection of and preservation of Neri. So yeah. there was a an an issue or the, there was a a proposal that a uh, a group of people took the the TL, all the TLM from the the custodian budget. 
uh, it went out viral, but uh, to avoid it, people said, okay, we're going to make an account where we're going to keep the TLM safe. So Neri proposed it and they took the TLM out to keep it safe in a, an account where the Alien Worlds uh, found, uh, not founders, but Alien Worlds, the, the admins have access to that account. And in case Neri's to custodians do it, something they don't like they can have access to that account and put the 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 funds back if you say something like that so let's say i i take some money from from the bank but but i keep i give access to the bank so in case i do something with the money that i'm not supposed to the bank can can take it back And that is by going against it. Basically, you've you've said you're going to do this, and instead yeah. of doing it, you went and swiped all the money or something. Yeah, exactly. So everything is public on the blockchain, so that's the the thing. So you can go ahead and say, okay, this guy, look, he traded with this and that. So everyone can hey, see what's happening. Hey, Marlo. Hey, Marlo. So that's why. So you can see here, consular honorarium. And they can modest compensation to each counselor, an opportunity cost, governance taking. It says a hundred dollars per council per week. So uh, that hundred dollars goes to them for their work during the week. So yeah. if, like I said, they they have that Telegram chat where they can speak everything and people that take part in it and just speak about anything or proposals and just the game and how they can improve to get more players and the game gets more populated and then more people stake and then everyone is better even the, the planets get more tlm staked and and then the governance gets more uh, budgets every week so everyone's happy because then the budget goes back to the community like this like with the sponsorship they they pay TLM to sponsor my stream, so then they expect from the stream more people will join in or to educate more people about Alien Worlds. No, it's not the new version. It's still the old version, the normal version. So in it's case still, you... uh, it's still Alien Worlds. Yeah. But basically, Governance. going through the whole. All the features. Yeah. So I'm asking you can literally do. the baby questions for anybody yeah. that is new to NFTs or Alien Worlds. And Xander's literally got to ask them all. Answer yeah. them all, sorry. Yeah. This way we can educate everyone that wasn't around. There's loads of opportunities. No, we can't call them opportunities, but they really are. Like you join. You mine NFT points and then every week you get a percentage of the rewards of that specific planet. And ooh. so not everyone is aware of that. So that's why I'm trying to make sure everyone is aware of what's happening on Alien Worlds. It's not just, oh, I'm mining, I'm getting this, it's not worth it. And then they, they go. I said, no, but it's not only that. You can join Twitch. You can uh, join trivia in Discord and you can win stuff, NFTs. And then you can go ahead and then there's a planet uh, that takes the the drills and it converts them into a better tool. So again, you you earn stuff. And then you start the earning more money. It's, it's yeah, no exactly. different than, you it's know, you, you're not instantly going to, you know, click mine 10 times in a week and become a millionaire. Nope. So it takes time, but at the same time, uh, they reward activity. So the these custodians, like in Neri's case, these five custodians or five custodians of each planet, they they go around, they do proposals, and they look at okay, we have people active in the community, we can reward that. So they just need to mine, or they need to be active in Discord, or something. They have to do specific tasks, and activity is rewarded. Like always, like everywhere. It's like, if I'm not working, I'm not earning my payslip. If I don't earn my payslip, I can't pay rent. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. So you put it's in also, the time. It's the aspect, uh, pretty much um, any game. Yeah, obviously, um, I stream games. Yeah. Like 
100 percent of the time it's pretty much what i do and when it comes to the aspect yeah you, you load a game up uh, you know you're talking mmos and things and whatever else you load a game up and you click and play to begin with but when you when you start to understand the fundamentals of you know i come from world of tanks i'm now raid and things like that yeah when you start to understand how certain things work you're able to become better at what you're doing so in this case you're able to become better and you're knowing more about it of how to get your trillion where to go and get a different nft to gain more trillium or your nft points or anything along those lines i literally don't do anything on this at the moment other than just click mine 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 yeah so hopefully once i finish clicking mine but yeah i can then start venturing out into the um get something for nft points you know fuse yeah that's what i was about about to, to say now let me get because last time i said i'm gonna get you one so what was it power it was one and then i'm gonna send it over and then you can mine with it and how many let's see and does one. that mean when i'm mining because i have this tool and yeah. i have the capacities does that mean i both i mine both nft points yes and tlm yeah exactly okay there's another question then do you have a set amount of tools you can mine with? Three at the or time. Say, so you... say if I had 10, 20 capacitors, could I mine with all 20 of them? No, maximum of three tools. So when you go to inventory... So you have to get rid of a capacitor to put this... Yeah, you just swap um, it. So yeah, you swap it out and then so, I start mining yeah. both. So when you but go to switch... you don't want to mine NFT points, only... Uh, yeah. TLM, I'll put the capacitor back in, or if I only want to mine NFTs, I'll put three of these uh, things in. Yeah, so if you go to your um, switch tools. Um, one sec, switch tools. Oh. Let's click the one on the right, change. And then above it, above your, when you click switch. Yeah, it uh, says shine at the moment, charge, look, mine, name. Power. Above, so uh, mining and then switch tools. Yeah, I'm on it. So it's like choose your inventory to mine, and then underneath is gonna say uh, you can use three tools at the same time. So you can use either three capacitors, three drills, or different ones. Like I have two of one type and one of one type. Yep. So that's this is how where you change them as well. So let me see what's the best tool at the moment for you to let me see power so or maybe power extractor or basic explosive let me see I'm trying to look The green screen is a. Uh, are you looking at a green monitor or something? Because it's reflecting on your face and you look like the Phantom of the Opera, mate. Oh, nice. I see that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this still has one. Or oh, is it gas? Yeah, here we go. Found one that gives you more. Uh, it gives you NFT points and nine NFT power as well. So let me go, boom, boom. So let me see. Did you, you posted earlier your your wham here? Anyways, yeah, it's up there in the chat. I should still be on copy and paste. I think actually, you know, so you don't have to scroll down. Yeah. Plus, I'm pretty check. sure that, and it just netted me another 0.0025. Yeah, well, there you go. So this is your worm at the moment. You got pretty NFTs. So now we go here. We go transfer. Welcome to Alien Worlds. <laughs> <laughs> you should have put get digged. <laughs> Start earning. So now. 
Go back to the game, press F5. Uh, once that once my mine's done. There you go. F5, quick refresh. And then go back to switch tools and... So what do you have on at the moment? Uh, I have three standard capacitors. Yeah, change any of them. Uh, oh yeah, it's now it's now instantly there. Uh, yeah. Gas rigged extractor. That's the one. Let's approve that. Okay, that's now in. Oh, crikey, that's just jumped up on it. It's like every 30 odd minutes now. <laughs> 32 yeah. minutes. Yeah, so it saves you time as well instead instead of staying out uh, every X amount of two, three, four, five, six minutes, then mm -hmm. like myself, I, I mine on a, on a different one, but I would say the move, like head over to, to where I am, for example, this is where the best time versus commission versus NFT points and everything else together. So if you switch, switch planet, You're on uh, Neron. Neron. Yeah, so switch planet. Yep. And then once you switch planet, click Neron. My Neron. On it. Yeah, and then at where it says coordinates here. Yeah. Click, type in 18. 18. Let me see if it, and then 11 in the other one. So we've got the uh, sandy coastline on Neron, yes? Yeah, and then click mine. Now, my question is, is why, yeah. well, obviously, uh, well, I need to, I need to wait 28 minutes, I think. Yeah, but it's, to, it's so less now and over. the, the points and everything, it's going to be better. So this one that we've just swapped over to, yeah, has the 4% at the top, which yeah. you say is the commission you pay to the landowner. Exactly. The one I've just come from was 1%. Yeah. The multiplier on this one is 1. 1.5. The one I've yeah. just come from was 2.1. Yeah. And I think the um, the one in the bottom right hand corner, the NFT power, was something like 1.9. Yeah. And this one's less. And this one's less. So why yeah. is this best to mine on than the one I've just come from? It's... Uh, you were on a different planet, first of all, right? Yes, I was. So, Neron, for example, every week, they um, they have a proposal where they reward the miners that mine NFT points. So, oh, right. So, as the more NFT points the you more mine, NFT points you mine the, the potential more TLM. you'll get more reward, or you, you'll get high enough to be rewarded. Yeah, you get TLM depending on how much you NFT points you mine. So, uh, for example let's hope by the time we finish you'll be able to mine and then you'll you'll see your first nft points at the top <laughs> and then you can make a educated guess on how many let's say you mine five six times a day and then it's uh, each week so on thursday so by the time next thursday uh, it's wednesday evening so by the time next wednesday evening comes you'll know okay i made like 100 nft points i will get this amount of uh, TLM because it's 0. 0.17 per mine or uh, per NFT point or something or per hundred or I can't remember exactly. But yeah, it whatever was, it is, it's yeah. um, it is what it is. I mean, I'm yeah. still sat here at 0. 0.00 no NFT points, but I never had one of those. Uh... Now you have a, a a tool that mines NFT points, so yeah, so. Obviously, I've got wax, yes? Yeah. Wax trillion is yeah. completely different, I assume? No, it's the same. When people stake, so when they go and add voting power, it's uh, it's going to show to vote for this uh, candidate or Nary syndicate, you have to need, you need vote power. And then you go here and then let's say you stake let's put five five tlm i'm converting five tlm to five nair nair is the same as tlm it's just the the planet token 
it's a so, planet token yeah. yeah so i'm clicking five convert now it's conversion successful now a refresh and it should here you go so now i have six instead of one on the left side and here then that is that so you need to transfer your trillium into yeah. staked no sorry uh, just to the that is top. how much you have now currently staked of your yeah. trillium yes yeah on uh, on area for example yes so it says see yeah, you and go then to that each... would also say if you started doing a mission on missions it's going to show you underneath would also be there would it not yeah uh, one second and your uh, staked wax so you'd still know you're going to get that back because you said told me you get all your staked yeah back anyway yeah for example look the the one on metamask is going to show me underneath here and it's saying bsc trillium with metamask hey club so there's currently a Apollo? if you go onto missions there yeah hey somebody's bought the clap yeah <laughs> am i the only one that got that joke yeah. let's make it clap oh so there's no, a new no, mission no. now it's, it's totally different obviously uh, unaware of the uh yeah english not... meaning of it <laughs> he's uh he, he lives close to me anyway so all right it's cool yeah. so in the missions there's one currently yeah. available yeah there yeah. wasn't one available on friday yeah so me with my entire 1.2 trillion no that that's not it you don't have any trillion because it has to be on binance your available available trillion is going to be here here so, on the right okay so yeah. how how do i get the available trillium to the you right will side? have to teleport which is here and then uh, yeah. above above missions once you have a hundred tlm plus some bmb for the gas fees you'll connect your wax BNB? yeah what the hell is bnb binance token another crypto token i see it up in the top right corner yeah yeah and then it's a uh, connect your wax wallet and connect your metamask and then to transfer and again you need minimum of, of 100 tlm so you need a minimum of 100 tlm to go on a mission yeah and like uh, a few yeah. cents of uh, bnb <clears throat> and where do you get the bnb from you buy it from an exchange so binance kucoin crypto.com yeah he's showing me binance here at yeah the moment. <clears throat> that's it and you buy that uh, you know do you buy that with wax do you buy that with clm do you buy that with no with, with money you buy Physical it with money, money. yes yeah. and then you come back and look this time it's going to show you so see here uh join mission and when i click join mission it's going to say one craft equals 40 tlm so if i want to select one so you, you could send like 10 or well you got what 700 so you can yeah. send Okay, yeah, I can send like, let me see. Yeah, so 17 ships. Mm -hmm. And then those 17 ships will be sent. And let me see how much is going to. At the moment, I'm going to get 0 0.427 TLM per ship. So if I send 10 ships, I'll get 4 TLM back. You get roughly, yeah, you get roughly half. Mm, no. So you basically go by uh, half a trillion per ship. Yeah, half, a, nearly half a trillion per ship at the moment. But the ship hasn't sent out yet, so it's starting in two hours. At the moment, there's thirty thousand ships, and normally they they come up to like sixty thousand, forty thousand, and so on. So like so this the more one, ships potentially, the more trillion you come back with. No, the less because see the reward here. It's thirteen thousand, and that's oh, gonna it, yeah. that's gonna be divided in the number of ships. So there was one there. That's a gold one. The third one down. There was seventy five, but it was only two hundred nine ships sent. The yeah. Third one down. Yeah, exactly. But this is a legendary one, which costs like yeah. five thousand TLM each. Yeah, clap. So, for example, let me try and join one, just for the sake of it. 
I'm not gonna join, but just to see. So to send the ships, it's gonna cost me. Huh? Is the gonna log into it? No, it, it's gonna cost me six cents. So if I want to send, look, it's gonna cost me Five six cents. cents. It'll cost you six cents, so it's about no, cents any. one cent. No, any, because look, even if I go the Oh, maximum, even if you did it to uh, the maximum, it would still be yeah. the same. Yeah, let me double check to use default. Still, six cents. So, it technically, what once you can do, it makes more sense to send more ships. Exactly, that's what some people do. Yeah, chips as chips. <laughs> Cheap as chips. <laughs> but yeah. That's what some people do. I, I know uh, there's a there's a guy that sends like few thousand ships at a time. On this, Oof. yeah, if it's worth it to them, like sending. Uh, yeah, yeah, indeed, yeah. You just because and then you, you calculate. Okay, I'm gonna get this amount, but I'm paying this BNB fee, which is six cents. And then when it comes back, when you claim it, you're gonna pay like uh, I think one dollar twenty in gas fee. So example, my missions, so I've been part of some missions, so I went ahead and claimed like, oh, see for this one, I've sent five ships and I got 0 0.23 TLM per ship. So I got like mm -hmm. one TLM per five ships. Yeah. I got five NFTs as well. So that's what it covers it. So because, getting the NFTs basically yeah. covered it. If you didn't get the NFTs, you would yeah. have been out of pocket on that one. Yeah. Yeah, and they they capped they capped the the NFT. So let's say I want to send a hundred ships to this animation. You will only get five NFTs max. So you send a yeah, hundred. Yeah. Well. yeah, only only five max per mission. So and then there was those two that were one NFT per mission, and then there was two or three, I think, on that third one. Yeah. So so these are like. I have two of these. The MU of these. ship the same as this? I don't know what that question is. Uh, the mining yeah. union. Miners union, that's where people vote with their NFT points. Is the ship? I don't know. I don't know, Clap. I think so, maybe. And then the, the NFTs that you get from missions are on the Binance chain, so you can't go on Atomic Hub or NFT or NFT Hive and sell them there. They are on, on that MetaMask, so they get saved on MetaMask. And then you sell them or use them. Uh, and then, you, well, you and either then, use them in-game or you... And then you head over... The yeah, from, from MetaMask, you can head over to fungible.com. I'm going to put a link because there's loads of people that don't know where 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 uh, fungible.com is it's a marketplace basically uh, so let me sign in let me go and see my profile then collections showcase i know somewhere here you have to look come on it's loading up but I can see them. I don't see the full picture, but I can see underneath. So Alien World Collection. Let me see. Try and see one of one. See some of them. They do show the picture. Some of them have rendered the others haven't. Yeah. Yeah, and when you go put on sale, it's probably gonna show you like the cheapest one. It should show you the cheapest one. Uh, let me try. Hmm. Uh, maybe the site's just a little laggy today. Maybe. I'm trying to see Alien Wars collections. Here we go. Alien Wars NFTs. So this is where they can see the NFTs on missions. Let me post that in the chat as well. All of the items. Yeah, it's a bit laggy. Don't know. I think some people go to Binance Marketplace as well. Yeah, I think it's... Uh, I can see some of them now. Yeah, yeah, they're loading up now. 
Yeah, so you can see 11 BNB, well, people are exaggerating a bit, but uh, then 0 0.0025 BNB, which is, let me see. Well, let's go for that 11. What's 11 BNB? 11 B, uh, it's uh, like. How much does he think he's going to get that one for? Uh, it's not going to sell at the moment until they learn. So 0 0.0025 is 70 cents. One BNB is two hundred and eighty-two dollars at the moment. So he's really trying to flog that for two grand. Yeah. So eleven. It's three point one grand. Three point one. Yeah, but it's not gonna sell. They're gonna. They just put them up there. They said, oh, in case it explodes or something, they're gonna sell. But not gonna happen. Yeah. But, yeah. I mean, you say it's not going to happen. Uh, I remember you telling me that there's been a few high-selling NFTs before now. Yeah, there they have been. And yeah, you never know. Like I said, the, because they don't have any utility at the moment and the the developers are working on adding the utility. I mean, that's, uh, that's mine. In the meantime. But... Yeah, mine just come up. Ooh, now you're going to earn your first NFT points? I will do. Let's see what it gives me. Come on, 10 billion. <laughs> 10 billion. That's yeah, it, clap. oil. Yeah, clap, you never know. Yeah, let's go back to... Because I still think that not everyone is accessing the, the governance as they should do. Because there's a lot to explore and... And like I was telling everyone, the power is in their hands, so you, they mine in uh, TLM. Right, so it didn't actually get <clears throat> any did. NFT point in that. Refresh the page. Ooh, 3.6. There you go. So you mine five times a day, that's like 16 points. So now that I'm doing that, I'm, after, I'm going to have to go back again. NFT points, what do you do with the NFT points? You click on uh, exchange, so go exchange hover over. It. And then you exchange you'll... that for more items for NFTs, in yeah. the game to use to go and do some more mining and stuff with. Mining or, or you can sell them, but things. only I'm saving mine for when specific NFTs come to, to market. Like there's some NFTs that come around every few months, so every uh, 23rd of each month they swap the exchange so underneath it you'll see expires in two weeks four days five hours something like that yeah yeah two weeks four days five hours yeah. 48 minutes and and uh after that they'll put new nfts but because this one they're they're just testing because the system is still relatively no new so they're just testing to see who's redeeming what are they redeeming so they're just testing everything so until well, this is the thing if you knew like me i mean uh, what the hell would he use a nordic and spiritually advanced but are also powerful warriors what the hell would he use that avatar for this is an avatar at the top top left yep, top where, one, you, yep. where your name is you just use it as is so at the moment that's it there's no uh, other utilities it's solely so... just for changing your avatar yeah exactly well, they can take a hike for starters. <laughs> yeah. So, and then... Uh, yeah, the... unless I'm literally farming billions a day. Yeah. And then... They can uh, jog on. Male Grey, that's going to be used in uh, in the future for the PvP game, which they they are working on. As far as I know, they're still working on it. A they have separate been. PvP game or an Alien Worlds PvP game? Because yes. all I can think of an Alien Worlds <laughs> PvP game is who clicks mine first, you or me. No, but look. That's literally... If you can see here, you have the male grey, which at the... Now, let me give you another example. Because yeah, you yeah, can't... I see it, male grey. Yeah. You, you can't see their dates there. So, let me go on the market. And then you go... Where is it? um arms so first of all arms you can see weapons and then once you click a weapon you'll see at the top left you'll see the attack power yeah and then, i have seen these weapons before somewhere yeah. Yeah, and, and then, i'm just curious why the hell 
do you need a weapon when all I'm doing is fucking digging a hole in the ground? I'm mining. Yeah. Well, that's that's what they're gonna be so for. So it's all prep for something bigger to come to Alien. Yes. Yeah, and then you see a uh, a Nordic warrior. He's got sixteen attack, uh, thirty speed, and then ten defense. So are they turning it into some sort of card game then? Well, yeah, it's it's gonna like, be literally because, like yeah. you battle Pokemon cards yeah. and. Um, so for example, or is it like a fucking top trumps game? Yeah. So you know, if you mine's bigger than yours, take that. Yeah. So there's a, a game. I get your NFT because mine's bigger. Yeah. So there was a there was a, a grant that uh, not Alien Worlds but the publisher Dakoko, the uh, G Hubs Galactic Hubs, they uh, they were giving grants to specific people. So it's Alien Worlds Galactic Hubs. So. A developer reached out and I said, "Okay, I'm a, I'm applying for a grant. I want to uh, develop a game based on your NFTs." So they went ahead, applied for a grant. Galactic Hubs gave them the grant. They went ahead, developed the game, and now they made Battle Dome. And I posted the link in uh, in chat. I know everyone knows about it. So you can use the Alien Worlds weapons and minions. That's what they called minions. Yeah, I was gonna say it's minions next. Yeah. And you can battle other people, which is, and the battles are RNG, so you can have good uh, minions and good weapons. And then you can uh, you can buy battle here, so you can see, see yeah, battle. Because history. all I'm looking at currently for NFT points is one tool, which is an exo glove. Yeah. The rest are avatars, which do nothing. And then there's minions and weapons which currently do nothing until yeah. this battle dome thing is out correct yeah no the battle dome itself is out it has been out for some time but the the alien world's uh, pvp game is not out but the weapons can be used in two different games at the moment so in the battle dome which is live now and then there's another game zombie survival which again it's it's a different game on uh, on wax but they uh, they were funded by the syndicate and they implemented alien world's weapons into their game because they already have like a they had zombies they they send the zombies in missions so now they added alien world's weapons that they can give to the zombies and when they go to battle they they battle other monsters so, well, let's hopefully we might get some sort of sponsorship for this uh, battle dome then, because I'm interested. You know, as soon as you mention zombie, fucking <laughs> my ears pricked. <laughs> Look, it's love it. massacr massacring zombies, dinosaurs, anything like that. Yeah. That game straight there. So this is the one. So zombie outbreak survival. This is what you're posting in the Discord, yeah? This. No. I'm sure this was in the Discord. No, there was another there's a zombie an... outbreak survival series two or something along those lines. I think so, yeah. Yeah, I think I posted this one as well. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, and yeah, see, they have uh, the zom the not the zombies, but the uh, the characters. Yeah, the characters, and then they go b battle zombies. That was the the one, yeah. And then well, hopefully yeah. that'll be something we can get into in the future after. Um... Yeah. Look, this is it. So see, Zos versus Alien World event is live. So then people, so the syndicate sponsored them. Uh, they added to some TLM as prizes, and then people that play and win, they get a, a part of that uh, pool. Yeah, so it's kind of, it's kind of becoming a. Um... So is it Planet Near that it did that, from the syndicate? Or... Uh, well, you can find all them proposals. Like, you can have a look on alienw.com, and then here. Uh, is it a pro is it a permanent proposal? That yes, is well... now in that. Um... I've already forgotten Battle Dome. That that was a grant. So they got the the money. They developed the game. And that's it. Uh, but I'm, I mean, in the crossover from uh, Alien Worlds to that. Yeah, it's a, it's ongoing. So that's now I'm, a permanent feature. Yeah, yeah. 
So if you're buying weapons and things like that, you're not going to lose out in like six months time when the that's you know, always start. a risk. When once you speak about crypto, that there's always a risk that that project might not develop further or that project might become too big and they're going to add more stuff and more stuff. You never know what happens tomorrow in crypto. Very much so, because exactly. I bought, you know, going off, uh, going off the tangent here, and I know I've always said we'll try not to since it's a sponsor one, but you know, me being me, um, <laughs> I bought Bitcoin back in whenever off me mate. My mate had some. I had no clue what it is, so he was telling me. Uh, so he, I, he sold me like five hundred quid worth of Bitcoin. It cost me, <clears throat> uh, I don't know, two hundred and fifty, three hundred quid, something like yeah. that. And that was like just before December of whatever year it was. I can't remember. And then come January, the amount I bought plummeted so bad. Yeah. Yeah. Massive. And I was like, basically, I just paid 250 quid. And now it's like worth like, it was must have been about 35 pounds. <laughs> and I'm sat here thinking, show me mate should stiff me over it and he you know he is my close mate yeah he was my best yeah. man at my wedding and all that so he's a close mate uh and then i just sat on it yeah i was like okay i'll sit on it for a bit uh went and did some stuff in a um got a brain's not functioning come on braid <laughs> where you do shit on the market trading the trading there you yeah. go Trading on the market, so I, you know, as a day trader and things like that, and yeah, uh, earned a few quid by that. And then I kept my eye on the Bitcoin, and then I actually noticed that at a point just before, um, just before the end of the year, it spiked again. Yeah, it always spiked just before December. Like I, I look back, and it was just like every December, and then into January, February, it dropped, yeah. and then went on. So I left it like two years. Um, and then, yeah, in the end, uh, I thought, you know what, fuck it, I'll just flog it as it is now. So that 250 quid, it took years. Yeah. Uh, I think it must have been about two, maybe three years. Uh, I ended up flogging that 250 quid for about 1,500 quid. Mm, see, exactly. And like you say, you just never know what happens. You could either hold on to it and yeah. it could increase, or as you said, you know, it can just literally drop off the edge of the world and never to be seen again. Yeah. Because with crypto, every two years, that's a bull cycle. And then every other two years, that's a bear market where everything is down and you accumulate. So it's called dollar cost average. So let's say this week I'm uh, I'm making like a, a goal. I'm buying every week $5, $10 or $20, whatever of uh, one coin or of five different coins. For example, let's say I have hundred dollars this week i'm gonna buy ten dollars bitcoin ten dollars this one and just yep. do like a direct debit of that and then comes the the bull cycle when everything goes up you'll see that ten dollars worth in the bear market in those two years accumulating you'll you'll see it transforming into like 50 quid 100 quid or even more there were some coins that people bought loads of them they bought like 50 dollars worth and then came after two years they were worth like a million dollars. And you know what? I actually had a, uh, this is, you know, again, just going off a bit here. I actually had bought a one whole Bitcoin at, when it cost like five pounds, you know? Yeah, see? And because I had no clue what it was, but I could buy games using this Bitcoin. So I was like, well, technically I'm getting more I get more because obviously I've been giving games away for years. Yeah. Like, you know, I, I could buy more games here at less of a cost with something I have no fucking clue of what it is. So I ended up just buying a shed load of like little bits of games with it, little bits of games with it. And that one whole Bitcoin that I bought for five pounds, I could have hold on to for about 10 years and sold it for like 40 grand. Uh, 68 grand. It went to 68 grand in. Uh... Did it go up to 68? <laughs> well, there you yeah. go. I, I still probably would have sold it at like 40. Yeah, that but... just goes to show, you know, if, you, if you're doing shit and you have no clue what you're doing. Yeah. To me, at the time, yeah, it was worth it. But yeah, you know, that cost me 35 grand. I want a whole Bitcoin. 
Yeah, there's loads of people that uh, there was loads of YouTubers that back then it was one dollar. Buy pizza. <laughs> yeah, like that guy. No, but there was yeah, YouTubers that were, they were telling people go buy Bitcoin, guys. It's one dollar. Buy it. No one listened. There were few of them that listened, and those become millionaires and live in Dubai and stuff like that. But. Yeah, go to the Monaco Grand Prix on the yachts and everything along those lines. Yeah. So, yeah, I was saying on, um, regarding Alien World. <laughs> on uh, AlienW.com, uh, regarding proposals, you can see all approved proposals, like, and uh, for how much and what the proposal is for. And then you scroll down and you can see all the history. So, you can see uh, the whole history of it and how much. See, the, they even made, so for the Turkish earthquake disaster relief, some of them made the proposal to donate some. And there's uh, there's people there, the uh, trusted people th that work for Alien was, for example, and others, that members of the community that can be trusted to say, okay, look, this is the TLM from the custodians. Uh, go and buy stuff for people that are in need and donate for from us. So they they did like a charity thing. Yes, yeah, very much so. Yeah. So, uh, you went yourself, you said, didn't you? Uh, you come back uh, not long back. No. <laughs> no. Who the hell have I been talking to then that said they did that? Not me. I didn't go. And uh, no, a uh, different person. Yeah. God, that was, uh, Are you ready? You want to go to Turkey? Truxton. <laughs> You want to go because Turkey? I was typing that because I messaged you like <laughs> every day. It yeah. was just I thought it, you know, just triggered. It must have been you, but obviously not. No, it was uh, yeah, it was Truxton. Yeah. So a few of them. Let me see. Turkish. I don't know why it's not showing. Submit okay, mine. Okay, no, it's working. So a few of them planets did. So I see. Um, Okay, one, and then battle them frequent. No. Okay, massive erection here. I'm up to seven point two NFT points. Ooh. Give it a See couple that. of months, and I'll be able to buy a, an avatar. <laughs> yeah. So where was it? This one. Twelve thousand. So see, there's another one that gave six thousand TLM, and then there's another one that gave twenty thousand TLM. And there's another one for ten thousand. Another one for ten thousand. So they, they gather some money, like I think. So they around. just got it from uh, the different custodians from each planet. Yeah, different custodians of each planet. They said, okay, let's let's put a vote. They voted, and boom. They uh, they made it happen. And go on, put that into pounds for me. Yeah. Well, it's, it's so probably how much was it? Total 10, seven, 10 million? 10, 10 million, million TLM is that? No, that's 10,000. <laughs> that says 10.000.000. That's 10 million. No, no, no. That's that's what they do. See, the, the comma is here. Yeah. And then there's a dot for decimals. Well, it's fucking tiny screen, mate. That, that looked like <laughs> dot, dot, uh, comma, comma, comma. No, no, no. That's one. So come on, yeah, put that pounds. <laughs> yeah, well, it's all together. It was like seven hundred quid or something. Yeah, yeah. Even still, you know, yeah, it's, yeah I can actually see it now. There, it's one hundred yeah. and sixty, three hundred and sixty-four dollars. Yeah, that was, that was one, and then there was another one for and twenty thousand. And then it's with the higher up, and then there's another yeah. one down there. Yeah, three hundred twenty-seven. And then the, there's a few one all together. So, like this one. The Zoss supercharge for milestone, they paid twelve grand. Fucking hell. <laughs> yeah, so like I said, there's this one went fifty fifty three thousand dollars. This uh this is where they pres they're preserving the TLM. So for future events and stuff like that. But that was the one you were talking safe. about before. Yeah. yeah, I think we yeah. were just off stream while we were just talking about something yeah, like that. Keeping it safe for, for, for Neri. And for the custodians and Neri, so whatever happens, we have it there. And if anything is required, we can use it for doing good. And then other stuff, bots. So there's 
people that the, all their that they have to do is look at uh, who's a bot and who's not because there's loads of tools on wax that tells you oh the one account is connected to a million accounts or it's connected to 10 accounts or it's a legit account so that's what some uh, some communities do they just check for bots and so to avoid so but yeah it's coming to that i mean it, you know it's good for that because that's not yeah. just bots in planet near is it that's yeah bots exactly all together in um in the whole Alien game worlds. yeah yeah because this game uh, this uh, no, for for neary to do something like that is massive for the game let alone yeah uh just neary doing it yeah so for Whoever example does alien worlds should yeah. be doing that themselves to be honest yeah so miners miners union the the team that did this uh you have to apply for it so you, you apply inside you pay 10 you pay 10 tlm as a fee to join the website well, you billy big bollocks there in third what am i looking at here yeah no this is the the way where people vote with their nft points so okay. you, you apply to to become a voter which is like 10 at tlm and then let me see i can claim my power now so every time you vote for nft point you get voting power on this website as well and then with that voting vote power you can uh, vote so successfully claim see i have 5940 vote power and now yeah. i can go ahead select the person i want to vote which is myself which is yourself yeah and then select max votes and then vote so i have 787,000 at the moment after i vote refresh the page from 787 it will go to 792 well i think some other people voted for me as well kind of reminds oh. me of the uh... oh, me myself 787 yeah 792 have you seen the third pirates of the caribbean where all the pirates vote for themselves to be king <laughs> yeah i've seen yeah it just reminds me of that yeah and, everybody and jack, just votes for themselves yeah, and jack voted for the <laughs> yeah that was the best one. yeah why that's did it? you not vote for me? Why? Why? Why did you vote for me? You should have voted for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah so... that's, that's literally just what it reminds me of. And clap obviously, is actually uh, here. once again voting power. Yeah, you'll have all yeah. my uh, voting power. That's for sure. But clap that in, in, is in chat. It's, it's this one. The clapinator. Why has it got? Is it clear? Does clapinator. it? Clapinator. I, I mean, I can't see. It just looks like a bunch of hieroglyphs to me. Yeah, that's that's how he uses his name in Discord as well. You see, we all do it. <laughs> yeah, you all do it. Vote for yourselves. Vote yeah, for yourselves. Yeah, he vote voted for himself. <laughs> but yeah, this is a, a, a way that this guy... So do you uh, lose these votes after a certain amount of time and then you have to restart it? Uh, I don't know yet. The The site is still new. The This way is still new. But I think at one point he's going to reset it or something something like that. And you got to be in the top three, did you say, about this? Yeah, top three. And then what do you get? for being in the top three remind me in top three he's gonna use the tlm that he has from other planets to vote for those Who's three he? uh the the team behind the website okay so they they made a, a proposal to make the website and then every week people are sending tlm to that account for for him to stake and have voting power for them not for them but for for those top three so whoever comes in top three he he takes that tlm stakes it and votes for those top three and that's what happened in my case here where well where is it Igor, kvn ike and that's what happens well boom that's how so this now guy... you have uh some power some say in making decisions yes in aiki yeah what to do with the blue and yellow stuff up at the top uh, the blue well, stuff up at the blue top. stuff but you can see it clearly on so you now uh, have to make proposals how often do you have to make your proposal or well, do you just make them whenever you think you make them well it depends on uh let's for example where is it aiki it's uh it's actually two thousand and six thousand 
but on the website i don't know why it's not showing properly but it's 206,000 tlm 206,000 ethereum so you have to make proposals within that budget so let's say i want to use 10,000 for a specific proposal i put it to a vote and you have you go here you custodian uh, center yeah you've got to get the um, you got to get the three out of five votes yeah so you can see here title through. two so it goes from the from the planet from planet aiki it goes to a specific address and then amount of tlm and then a memo like you can have you can have like a, what is it a memo custodian yeah. weekly allowance for example and then here in description i describe as best as i can what this the proposal will do penis enlargement yeah <laughs> <laughs> that's it <laughs> first thing that popped into me i don't know why it was that's just... it with the pump <laughs> You know, that, that's a selfish mindset, I suppose. But yeah, it would be. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I mean, do you buy land? Do you, can you create land? Or. No, you, you can only buy it from the secondary market. So they, you, they could make a proposal and say, look, we, we want to buy a land and all the commission that comes from that it land. It won't work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah right so yeah they, can, they could make a proposal where they can buy a land but who's gonna hold it that's the thing they could say oh look we're gonna buy a land we can use this tool yeah but then one of you things. has to own the land don't you yeah, yeah. and then it's that person that's gonna get the uh, commission every time somebody mines on it unless there's a they could do like a, an account where whoever well, that that doesn't work they ha it has to be like from someone independent for example that can be trustworthy or they can say okay we made this proposal that stays on planet the that planet that made it and then they can use a tool they can say okay minus that mine on this land will get airdropped let's say random nfts i was gonna say could you not like uh, you know this is just when you could you not like um say again it would just be for one person but you could i don't know uh, could, can you like give land to somebody yeah but so you that's... could swap the land between the five different custodians yeah but again that's how, how, how are you gonna like because that land produces tlm every day every hour every yeah so it was like all i was thinking is if it was like you know you put a one percent commission on the land yeah you start it on Monday. Mm -hmm. um, and then whoever, you know, the entirety of Alien Worlds can, like, go mine on there. And for those five days, there's a chance of dropping an NFT or something. Yeah. And then you pass that bit of land at a certain time to the next custodian, still at 1%. Yeah. And then they all might everybody mines under well, let's say I'm looking at Varan at the moment. So Varan yeah. would start it. Pass it over at midnight to Dwayne. Dwayne. Mm -hmm. Dwayne, yeah. Yeah. He would then pass it over to Adam on the Wednesday. On the Thursday it goes to uh Yunari. And on the Friday it goes to any observer. Yeah. And then after that, the Saturday and the Sunday, there's no commission, so everybody's got the one percent. There's no commission on the Saturday and the Sunday, but for the entirety of that one, that seven days, or just the five days that you currently hold the land, there's potential for anybody to get an NFT through mining. Yeah, but I mean, I don't can... know if you have to go through things. I don't know if Alien yeah. Worlds would have to create something separately to allow you to do that, or if it's something you apply to the land yourself. No, it's not Alien World. This is there's an independent website that has these tools so let's say they verify uh the web because bots mine as well so when bots mine on that alien land they can get that nft for example so um there have been a few tools that they went go ahead they they have to verify those addresses that mine there's sometimes there can be ten thousand twenty thousand a hundred thousand addresses 
And, and if the whole of Alien Worlds is doing it, that's a lot of uh, addresses to verify. Exactly. So sometimes it takes a long time to verify. But there are tools around. Because obviously my brain just triggered because there was a um, Nary put out that proposal about removing bots. So if they literally yeah. pulled everybody into Nary, uh, you, you yourself, or if somebody from Nary actually did that, yeah, literally all the bots and all the humans obviously would go to that area solely to mine because currently you can't get any NF NFTs currently from mining, can you? There are some lands that owners still drop NFTs, like Crypto Monkeys on Nary. There's a, that's their planet, so they have loads of lands, and if everyone that mines on their lands, they, they get random NFTs and uh, Crypto Monkeys stuff because they, there's a big it's a big group, so they mm -hmm. go ahead and verify the WAMs before sending out the, the NFTs. And again, that would be a massive, massive job. Yeah, it is. But at the end of the day, the, that's all they do. At the end of the day, if they're all earning 1% of 100,000 people mining constantly every day. Yeah, but that's still not a lot. You can imagine there's people that have land and have four or five lands. Yeah, 5%. 10%. Uh, yeah. I want to put it to. Mining again. Let me see. Still got a minute on mine. <laughs> yeah, whatever they want to put it to, yeah. they then have to go through. I mean, it's five of them, so you know if it's that's like twenty thousand. Yeah, well, would that like... not be enough paid to do that work? Like I said, there's a guy that has four land. I think like uh, three or four percent. And he makes around, what did he say, around 700 TLM per week or something like that. Because I know per day, per land, you get around 68 TLM. But that's uh, just the commission of having a land. So beside the miners, whatever, let's say another 20, 30, 40 TLM max. So that's around, what, 120 TLM per day from miners and... Uh, from the commission so 120 trillion per day per per land so and that's not much for... yeah but how many people are mining on it so this is what i mean yeah obviously uh it has to if literally so many people are all going to it yeah but it has surely to you're probably going to have to stick a zero on into that so it's like 1200 yeah, TLM. the more miners that go Maybe on one per land, day. that could even be per hour. Yeah, but the more miners that mine on one land, the less, uh, what you call it, uh, the less rewards they get. The less rewards they get, the less rewards you get. It's like that pot. So when you go to switch tools, you'll see that uh, you have, uh, let's see, where is it? Uh, mining power, I have 3.9. Yep. So that 3.9%, it's 3.9% of the 0 0.8 TLM. But if... I chose at 3 point, I got like 14.3 mining power, right? Eh? Yeah, but mine are sp strictly for, uh, what you call it, for NFT points. So I have 39.6 oh, right. NFT power. Yeah, I have 5.4. Yeah, so when I mine... Yes, I see, exactly. Like yeah, I got 60 the capacitors, points, yes. 60 NFT points or something like that. For 30 minutes, top this 30 minutes on the dot. So yeah, there's a there's plenty of way to distribute NFTs and reward it to miners, but again, it takes time and it takes dedication and time mainly. Indeed, right. So for f next Friday, yeah. I want to ask you questions about all the um, activity going on in your Discord. Mm -hmm. uh, the giveaways uh, it's in the giveaway channel mainly that pops up in it yeah I think so it's obviously we're uh, running over the hour now yeah I've seen That's why we can mainly around the, uh, well what keeps popping up are these beds uh, that's that's from, from my project doing collaborations and stuff yeah so we'll you know we'll jump into that uh, 
Nothing to do That's with the Friday, Alien Worlds. <laughs> oh, oh, is it not for Alien Worlds? That no. One, not it's because that's in, it's in my Discord. It's in my somewhere else. Yeah. I get you, I get you, I get yeah. you. So that's doing collaborations. Like I have my own project. I'm doing collaborations with the other project. We create something together and we can share that with the community. That's what keeps the, the projects flowing. The collaborations. Indeed, indeed, indeed. Yeah. So yeah, thanks for for coming tonight again. It's quite all right. Uh, uh, you know, two days, two streams. I'm learning a bit. Oh, and appreciate the uh, the gas red extractor one because oh, now you can get be... the oh, NFT points. Yeah, <laughs> and my NFT points I could turn into voting power. Correct. Yeah, correct. Yeah, there you okay. go. See, I did learn something new today. And then you can vote for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Stick myself in, get to the top, I've no fucking clue what I'm doing up there. Uh get rich or die trying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, yeah until, we'll uh, next Friday we'll uh we'll keep uh, it close. Yes, I'll see you all then. Yeah, so thanks everyone for coming in. Have a good one all. Yeah, and uh and I appreciate you, you inviting time. me on again. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll talk on next Friday. All right, man. I'll yeah. see you then. Okay. See you later, chat. See ya.